Hello guys, it's Evan, and today I'm doing another mod tutorial and spotlight. Um, this is a mod that lots of you know, it's a very popular mod, and it's called um, the Better Than Wolves mod, and this is for 1.4.2. Um, this has actually properly come out um, today, it's not so long ago, so I'm going to jump in there quickly before anyone else does. And I'm going to show you how to get this mod. So what you want to do is come to the first link in the description which is the better than walls mod installer for 1.4.2 um... so then you want to go down and find this um... button here which is download the exe uh... this is a direct link so there's nothing wrong with it so it's just a quick download um... and what you want to do next is you want to find the your downloads folder which is in your downloads or wherever you have it um, saved to to download. Um, so my one's here, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag that onto my desktop, and then you wanna double click on it. Now, before you install the mod, make sure you have gone into dot Minecraft and deleted your dot Minecraft. If you have not done this, it probably won't work. So please, please do that. Otherwise, it's not gonna work. Um, there are many other reasons why it might, might not work, and if you have a 32-bit computer, please tell me, because if it hasn't worked, maybe there's a slight pattern here. I'm not sure if it's worked for anyone with a 32-bit. Um, also comment if it has. So, come here and press Install Mod, and you can back your Minecraft up if you've got anything on there you need to. Otherwise, press No, and it will start installing. Um, so, th this mod it has lots of things you can do. Um, it started... Quite, it started off in 1.7.2, I believe, this mod. Um, I'm not 100% sure. Um, the Yogscast have done a tutorial on it that got very popular, and the mods kind of spiralled up from there. So I'm going to be um, giving, after this is downloaded, I'm going to be giving you a little bit of um, an insight to what you can do. Just a quick one, so you guys can kind of see what's in this mod, and if you haven't got it, then what you can do, and if it's any good for you. Um, this mod is... is kind of a bit like um, the Technic pack. Um, it's not a pack though and it's a separate mod but there's things in it that kind of relate to TechIt if you've played that. Okay so when it's done installing press close and you will always get this message here. Press cancel it does not make a difference what that message it will always come up. Um, if you want to find out why there's a link uh, there's posts on the forum about it there's something you can get that will stop that happening but it does not make a difference. So, open up your Minecraft and open up a single player world. So, I'm going to do it in creative for you guys. Uh, what am I going to call that? It doesn't really matter. There we go. That's good enough. And we're going to create a new world. Um, it, this mod is, um, pretty cool. I uh, haven't played it before actually. This is the um, second time playing it. I've played it once, but otherwise I haven't really played it. I believe I'm falling. Okay, right. The jungle. Right. My computer's not great, so let's just turn it down. Right. So. Let's get up and go. Right. I'm gonna go find somewhere to show you some bits and bobs of what you can do in this mod. And um, this is there's lots of things you can do. It kind of revolves around power sources and um, kind of getting sustainability in a way. But I'm going to try and find somewhere to be able to do all this. So over here looks okay. Right, so come into your too many items and you can see instant you've got half blocks. Um, You've got the thing which is, um, I will show you in a minute, that you can cut them with. Um, we've got blood wood. Okay. I'm not sure if that's a tree or you craft it. And is there anything else here? Nope. Okay, and decorations. We've added... We've got wicker, grate, and slats. Canvas. Okay, that's different. Flower pots. I'm not really familiar with 1.4.2, so I don't know what the hell those are. I know they're in 1.4 though. A vase, uh, lots of stuff. A companion cube. And these are quite funny. It's this one is better than wolves, so obviously the people who have made it don't like wolves. So you get a really little dog salmon. You hear it. But it's basically to have a compressed dog in your living room, so you don't get lonely. 
and it doesn't get in the way. That's kind of the idea. Um, moving on, we have lamps, which these lamps are I actually find are a lot nicer than some other lamps. Um, depending on your opinion, the texture pack, but that's what they look like when they're on. I think they're pretty neat, to be honest. Um, you've got a cold. Um, there's loads and loads of cool stuff in here, but I'm going to show you how to um, set up a quick windmill. So you need this is how you get power to power something called a where is it gearbox. Uh, there's like a grinder or something. Oh, I'm terrible with this. Um, there's loads of fork things, I don't know what the hell those are. There's egg. There's steak. There's art refined swords and stuff. There's a composite bow. So there's like good bows and there's some weird stuff there. There's ender spectacles. Put them on. Ooh. Maybe they do something in the end. I don't know. Um, um, what else do we have? Apart from that, there's not much. There's loads of weird stuff in here. There's candles. What do you do with these? Oh, you have to light them, hold your in them in your in. There's another coal. This is like an upgraded coal. But um, this is mod is really cool. Um, I'll show you one cool thing. This is a hibachi or um kind of cooking thing. Now, I believe you give this power of some sort, and basically what it is, is it's like a cooking, so let's get some food, some food, mm, pork. Now there is a way of cooking this, um, I think you need a cauldron above it actually, so cauldron, Oh, I'm not really sure how we're going to set this up. But in the cauldron, you put on a piece of pork. And you can basically cook everything in one go, which is pretty neat. Now, I think what you need next to the um, this is a lever, I think. It's not a button. Ah, there we go. Uh, but that destroyed the cauldron. But this basically makes fire. I think you have to have it one block higher. So, um, brick, 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 brick. There we go. Okay, so, I mean, this mod you could, it's basically kind of household things as well. So it's actually re it's a really neat mod, and I really like this mod actually. Um, but look, you can now see. I believe it has power because you can see the smoke coming out of it. So what I'll do for an example is, is I believe you can get donuts. Now to make donuts you need something you put in. I think it's I don't know what it's called though. I believe it's called some sort of powdery stuff which you hmm, I can't remember but you can make donuts but there's a type of powder you put in. I can't remember what it's called though. You can make that uh, Hemp. I think you grind down hemp and it makes some sort of like flour or something. Hemp looks a bit like cocaine. It's quite weird. It's quite funny as well. And I think you have to plow or soil or hoe it. There's a hoe. I never use hoes. Oh, also, if you're growing hemp, which I have no idea how. You have to um, have light above it, so one of those lights above it. So make it make it look like a weed room. That's my advice. You have lights above them to make them grow. Um, I'm not going to get bothered with that. But with this hibachi, you can. Let's just a little bit of pork. I mean, this is what this is just amazing. And this is all going to cook at once. Even if I put it in right at the end, it should just all go roughly at the same time stack it. So, can you imagine you have your different types of food? Um, and this was before food can stack. This was pretty damn useful. So then we'll all go 
and if you put them in roughly the same time, I mean, this just kind of saves the time. You just chuck it all in, you go. It's not like a furnace one. There's max is 64. You can imagine how much food you can put in here. And can you imagine before food stacked how useful this is? This is just like completely. This is really useful before food could stack. But with this, you can you can make cool map adventure maps with this. Like, I mean, I'll give you an example. I mean, this is a terrible example, but adventure maps wise this is a pretty good idea so I don't think that works but but whatever you you can get, you can get the idea you can power I think I believe you can power this with redstone somehow I'm not even sure if you can it might just be a lever whatever I mean, I mean you can like make it so when you get all this it powers the lever and then you can burn your way through this wall. I mean, there's po endless possibilities with this. And you've got your saw here. And you power all of this with windmills and axles. Um, if you want, you can go f find out how to do it. Um, the versions are almost the same, so if you just watch an earlier version, if people haven't done it with this version, it should, should be okay. Um, another cool thing is this um, a cement bucket. Um, pour it down. It's like this weird soul stand stuff. And it makes a really horrible noise. And it spreads everywhere. And imagining, you can imagine probably what it does. But then it turns into stone. And if you fall in this stuff, you like drown. The um, mush. This mush, yeah. But, yeah, look. Th I mean, this is a really good way of making like a really quick house. I mean this is like you could make a frame with something like oh I need to quickly make a house or so you can construct a wall for your entrance. This is your wall. I mean this is this is just one of the hundreds of ways you can do epically cool stuff with this mod. Um, this is one of my favourite mods. I mean, look, you want to make a wall of a house, you just go around putting buckets in like this. And it should fill everywhere up. Other than a matter of time, you've got, you've got a wall. And you can do this for quite a long way along. And these buckets, I'm not sure how you craft them. But this is this is the um, Better Than Wolves mod, um, guys. And I hope you found this useful and interesting. Um, please like and subscribe. That's it from me, guys. I hope you found this um, enjoyable and useful. Um, goodbye.